you have cataracts or you know someone who does, you are definitely going to want to see this story. This is really crazy. So I found out about a procedure. It's called panoptics that people are loving. So in this week's Be Well with TCL, Dr. Chu from Chu Vision Institute explains exactly what panoptics is and why it is changing people's lives. Check this out. So this panoptics is the latest generation of intraocular lenses for patients who undergo cataract surgery. Why it's exciting, it's because it's, it gives the patients the widest range of vision, distance, intermediate, and near, more than any other lens implant before its time. I'm no doctor, and you know that, Dr. Drew, <laughs> but I would think that one lens could maybe correct one thing, that if you, you know, if you're having trouble, if you're nearsighted, correct that, farsighted, but there, that's what seems to be really revolutionary about this process, yeah. is it's correcting multiple things all in the same lens. I fear asking you this question. How does it work? Yeah. So the traditional lens is what you described. It has a single focal point. Mm -hmm. So wherever we set it, we typically set it for distance. Right. And patients know this because they still have to wear reading glasses after surgery. Mm -hmm. But nowadays, patients know more of their friends who've had this technology or other technologies that give them this range of focus, because much of our world now is at the computer screen and up close. I'm 70 years old. When I turn in my 40s, you know, I, I do high-end custom cabinets, and I like to work out there because I was a North Dakota farm boy, dairy farm boy, so all of a sudden, you know, you can't start seeing the lines when you make a pencil mark, and then all of a sudden you can't read fine print, and so then they get prescription glasses when I get close to 50, and then when you're out working and you got to look under stuff, that's a problem. So then I got contacts and that was like one of the greatest things for me when I got contacts. But I can't golf in contacts because I had bifocals and then you get prescription sunglasses and you can't golf in those and then you put regular sunglasses on and things are dark and then the hassle of putting them in, taking them out and doing all that. So and optics is a, is a lens technology. The procedure is cataract surgery. So most people know someone in their family or a friend who've had cataract surgery. So it's different than LASIK. The best part about cataract surgery is you get to be asleep. So you get an oh, IV, you get anesthesia, if you choose, most people do, and you get to be asleep. So you don't see or feel anything coming towards your face. See, this is not about uh, getting out of glasses to look better. Mm -hmm. This is getting out of glasses to be more independent, to be more free in your life, to connect better with the world around you. So why I do surgery, why I'm still passionate, is because we help people see better and connect with the world around them better. So I had it done in July. I had it done one week and I had one eye one week and one eye the other week. And you know, of course it's a little blurry right after you get the first one for a couple days and then you get the second one. And I mean, it changes your life. Like you just can't believe the gift that you were just given. And I try to think about it <clears throat> at least every month, if more than every couple of weeks, just think about how lucky I am to get this and they'll last me the rest of my life. <laughs> Think about that. What else can you say that about, Brad? You know, hardly anything. <laughs> not much. Goodness. We've invested not just in the technology to help people see better, but also incredibly in the technologies to help diagnose who shouldn't have surgery. And you know, there are weeks where we turn away 30% of the patients who are candidates. And, uh, you know, but those are the patients that I think ultimately, once they're over this appointment, are the most appreciative of what we offer. Right. What would you say to the person who's too nervous but knows that they need a solution? I would say there's nothing to be nervous about. As long as you have the right person doing it, and as long as you have Dr. Chu doing it, um, there, in my opinion, there's just nothing to worry about. It that was great. really great to talk to I Brad, too. That. He was just so in love with what has happened. Great to see Dr. Chu again, too. So here's the thing. If you're interested in finding out if you or somebody you know might be a good candidate for that panoptics procedure, or LASIK for that matter, reach out to the team at Chu Vision today. We put a link to their website over on ours. Go to TwinCitiesLive.com and click on fun. Let me add this, too. Uh, Dr. Chu will not just put everyone through. He no. mentioned it there in the story. He's not just trying to make a buck off you. He said they have to turn away some 30% of people who want procedures done because they deem that it's not the best thing for you. So he's looking there at you your go. overall care. So if you have any nervousness about that, yeah, he's the guy. Dr. Dr. He's the guy to talk That's to. That's great. Yeah. Next up.